Our guest is Mitchell Clark, uh, Erie-based entrepreneur. You sell a protein, you've got an alcoholic beverage with protein in it, and it's really taken off in the last year. Take us through protocol, how this came about, and, and what the last year has been like. Yeah, absolutely. So uh, we're from Erie, myself and my business partner, Josh, grew up here in Erie, started the company actually right out of college in uh, summer of 2020. You know, after graduating, and we really just wanted to start a company of some kind, mm -hmm. but realized this is a really unique opportunity for people who live active lifestyles, like to work out, always looking for protein, but they're also looking to enjoy themselves. Hang on, we're going to stick a microphone on you because we're not sure that yours is working. So, we're going to take John's and steal it because yeah. that's how we roll. All righty, we're improvising. Continue telling us about sure. protocol. So, you know, that's kind of, I mentioned uh, the target audience. It's that that person who loves to be active and fit, but also most of those people love to enjoy alcoholic wow. beverages and enjoy themselves. Uh -huh. So I realized protein, high protein alcoholic beverage didn't exist. So we decided to make it happen. Launched back in January of earlier this year onto the market, you know, in the retail stores across Northwest PA, and then have also expanded uh, into Ohio and Connecticut uh, and a few other areas. All right. So for the uh, what's the ingredients? Do we have a lot of caffeine in this? Is this the what, what, what is the boost? So there's no caffeine in it. Oh, um, in that case, that's great. <laughs> yeah, so 8% alcohol, the alcohol in that's it. That's pretty hefty. Yeah. This is almost like, like Canadian. Yeah, yeah, it's about double a uh, standard beer, right? An average beer is about 4%? Yeah, 4 or 5, so it's almost okay. two and a half light beers. Well, you said we didn't have it, so you keep Absolutely. It. We're going to do the orange. Pour, pour some up. Let's do it. All it's right. the orange creamsicle. Oh, the creamsicle. I love creamsicle. Also got a strawberry and a pina colada. Uh, we got, we got a couple hours. So now into more than 200 stores. At what point in the last year did you realize, wait a minute, this isn't just a concept. This is a legitimate thing that, that, that we're going to be able to make work. At what point did it click for you that we've proven the concept, away we go? Yeah, I don't know if there was one specific moment, but I think we, social media we and online, we could kind of see the interest we'd been getting and knowing, like, there's something more here than just uh, you know an idea or a concept, like you said. And then we've kind of proven it out through you know, sales uh, over time. Mm -hmm. So that it's really just been a, a consistent. Like process. that one famous TV show. What are your sales? Right. Are they good? <laughs> they are. Uh, we've been on the market about 11 months, and so those. I feel like Okay. Those sales reflect Pennsylvania, Ohio, and Connecticut, and they're going pretty well. And what can we expect for Erie? If this scales up, could we see jobs in our region because of your business? Yeah. I mean, long term, one of our goals would be uh, to build it big enough where we could develop our own production facility that you know could generate jobs and income locally, because right now all of the production is outsourced through co-packers. All right, we've got 30 seconds. I'll let you right. two sample this oh, here and tell me what you think. I'm, 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 I'm right. inclined to be Cheers. a spectator here. I'm not here. a big alcohol drinker, so this is... But you got the llama glasses oh, here. I got the llama glasses. Thank, uh, thank Terry McGraw for giving these right. <laughs> All right. All right, John, what's, what's the verdict? Oh, my God, this is like really good. It really is. <laughs> John's going to take that as a gift, and yes. I, and I, I'm not an alcohol drinker, but I don't taste much of that. It tastes like a creamsicle. When he comes yep. back jacked in a couple of weeks, you know what he's been up to. I'm going to work out. This is motivation, right? 